Okay guys, welcome back. So Ryan is wanting to put some penetrating epoxy on his board that he cut, which is really, really cute. And so I had a board for a project that I'm doing that I wanted to um, put penetrating epoxy on. So we're going to both do it at the same time. I'm going to do mine and then we'll mix and air, uh, Ryan will do his. So mine is Carob. And the reason we really wanted to show you is just to show you how this thing is going to pop once the penetrating is on there. How are we doing on time, Mom? Uh, we're at like 145. So this penetrating epoxy has to be stirred two to three minutes. So we did that and we just made three ounces. So we got two ounces of a part A and one part, one ounce of part B, which is the hardener. So I may need to make more probably for uh, Ryan's board, but anyway here we go so check this out this is again this is i believe this is carob i'm pretty sure and this i am probably got my arm right in the way you yeah can. a little bit over oh there we go but look at that board man i made other things with this before and i've had this piece for a long time but um it is amazing. That is a beautiful board. And I want to get the penetrating epoxy on because once I cover this with resin, I just think it's going to be very airy and there's going to be bubbles everywhere. So I'm just going to put a bunch of pop penetrating on there and try to... Put a bunch of Even that white pops out. Yeah. I just love this board. You've had this one for a while? I've had it for a while, and I believe I got this board up at the wine glass bar in, uh, up in the Phoenix area, wine glass bar, um, sawmill. Oh, okay. Yeah. You haven't been there yet. You're going to have to go. Yeah, That'd I haven't be been awesome. there yet, but I want to meet those guys. Yeah, they're two pretty cool dudes. All right, so have enough for you just to do yours. If now, do you usually put it on the back, too? You know what? You can, I, you know, but I'm not going to. It just seal, it seals it up in the front, so like... That's it, really all I really care about is the front. If it gets airy and there's bubbles on the bottom, I'm not too much worried about it. Okay. So... They wouldn't, like, float up to the top? They might, but they'd come around the edge and... Um, I think it'll be all right. Oh, all right. All right. I'm going to trade places with Ryan, and then he is going to do his board. So I may not need to, because you're just going to brush it on thin. If we need to put a second coat, we can do that later. Okay. So, switch. Now I can get my fat hands and my gloves. Put the gloves on first. Well, I know, but I didn't want to touch the camera. It doesn't listen to you ever, no matter how old you Yeah, are. I'm figuring that out. <laughs> Okay. All right, so you saw Ryan carve this. Isn't that cool? That really is. Look at how that oh. cedar just comes alive, and it's gorgeous. You can put it on there thick. Don't worry about it. Again, if we need to make more, we'll make more. Okay. Whew, this stuff's a tad strong. Yeah. A lot of people say you should be wearing a mask, which you know, yeah. you probably should. They say that about carving, too. We're, we're rebels. Go ahead and throw that anywhere, Mom. <laughs> it's a broom, so I could throw it right upside your melon. You could. Or make me go to my room and go to sweep. No, you would like that too much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this, this board is... Put some on your brush. It's not good. Oh, all right, all right. There you go. We've got plenty. If you need more, we'll put more on there. I know. I just it because like almost like finish the the excess bothers me. It soaks in. That's what it's designed for, That's right? What it's supposed to do. Okay. You're such a little girl. I know. It's <laughs> pathetic. Yeah, this thing. I think Amy's going to love this thing. Yeah, she is. That's beautiful. Wiggle, you see it 
Ja, ja. I can't. What? What's wrong with how I'm doing it? I'm. You know, you. First of all, let's get your phone. Oh out. yeah, good call. You're being very girly. How am I being girly? Okay, let's say you're being very your daddyish, very analytical and precise, and. What? Well, I guess just because I'm such a slob with this stuff. I, just, I mean, yeah, I'm not like throwing the brush across the room or anything. Yeah, see, we have plenty. Yeah. So that's okay right there, how it no, puddles up? You're kind of cleaning up a little bit. Okay. Know. Now, I would just take the rest of it and pour it around and then brush it in. Make oh. sure your sides are all covered. Okay. And I would do the ends again because that tends to be, you know, because they're open. Yeah, where it really soaks in. I would rather have too much of this penetrating than, you know. Than not enough? And then the resin soaking in and. Now does the resin soak in pretty bad even though it's real thick? It can, absolutely. All right. be garbage because you can't use it twice. All right, kids, we will be back and keep you posted. All right. Yeah. At a time until it's the right color that you want because it doesn't take much. Okay. Where are we at on time? 147. Okay. Does it feel pretty loose? Pretty oh cool. yeah, it's good. It's good. Yeah, it's nice. And when you're stirring resin, you don't want to whip it. Because then, see, as it is, we got bubbles, but these will pop. Oh, if you okay. whip it, you're going to end up with just foam. So there is no Even if you whip it good? That's what I was going to say. <laughs> There is no such thing as whipping it good. <laughs> it's creepy. Met Dad's chiropractor today. Nice guy. He's a nice guy. Big fella. Yeah, he's tall. Tall. Super good golfer. Really? Oh, golf is his thing. Chiropractor. That's why he has Tuesdays off. Okay. Oh. We on time. 2.45. It's like uh, the vet we go to uh, during duck season. He's off Wednesdays. That's it? Duck hunting? Yeah, duck hunting. Wednesdays, don't even try. His son works there like the office is open, but him, gone. So just a little at a time? Yep. You got it. Like that All much? Right. That's too much. There you go. Now take another stick and stir it. Don't put that one in there because you can't put that back in there. Gotcha. And no whipping. No whipping. Resin lessons. So right there, he's got about two ounces of black, which he's going to use to fill up the paws here. Timer, please. And I didn't mix enough. 
for the red, so I'm just kind of mixing up a little bit. How does that look? Oh, that looks good. Yeah, okay. Do you, what do you think? You like it? Yeah, looks good to me. Now, yeah. it's black. You're going to pinch that cup and you're going to pour it in in the middle and let it spread. Go slowly. You're going to drizzle it. Drizzle. Drizzle. Schnizzle drizzle. That's right. We're going hood up in here. Uh, we gotta. All right. But that's okay like that? Yeah. Okay. I would start up here and work your way down. Nope, hold on. Look, watch. Pinch it. Pinch it. And slow. Okay. And you're gonna try and just like fill it halfway up? Is that the way? Yeah, we wanna the... let it you're gonna drip. Get it down in there. More here? No, well let it let it go and see. Oh. It was a little faster than I had anticipated. On the dangerous side there. Because we're trying to avoid anything getting on the surface, right? Yep. Then why is that? Because we don't want it on the surface. Good answer. <laughs> there we go. All right, hold on. Before you do that, let's take it back off because you're going to drip. I'm going to keep those drips off. All right, yeah, put a little bit more in all of them. Okay. Can you hand us a paper towel, babe? Okay, hold on. Tension is high. It is. This is very more in here. Yep. I think I'm gonna need more for just the black. Yeah. If you do, we'll make it. Okay. Well then. We want just, we don't want it completely filled up because we want to pour clear over it and give it some depth. Depth. This is a, a red that it's uh, that I got at Workbench Con. Gosh. Ooh, I don't know how long ago. Two or three years ago. Two or three probably. years ago from Total Boat. Okay. And with red, you must be careful. Must what be is that? Careful. When well, you're pouring it, because red is kind of a pain to get out of the board. I don't know. I imagine with um, the penetrating epoxy, it would be easier. Okay, maybe wouldn't recommend this for. We have had uh, issues with red kind of bleeding into, especially light colored boards like pine. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah, yeah. It um, it's kind of weird the way it is. See, that is a pretty red. All right, I want to hand me one of your Dixies because I do want to put it in the Dixie cup. Amy's gonna dig this, man. I think she's really gonna like it. I just right. So many things can go wrong. You're a long ways from being done. Yes, so I'm I know. Just, I'm, just I'm, saying, being, I'm trying to be optimistic. And that's good. That's good. But generally, your mom and I stay silent until it's oh. done because we well, jinxed ourselves so many times. That rule would have been nice to know <laughs> 10 <laughs> minutes what ago. Black? <laughs> so we're done with this then, right, Mom? Correct. Okay. Oh, you had plenty, didn't yeah. you? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So over the red. Yeah, I want you just to start it. Kind of like this. Okay. And then let it. All right. Don't don't get carried away. Take your time. Squeeze it. There you go. You can go a little bit faster than that. Faster, slower, faster, slower. All right. When you get go a little bit further. Ooh. Bam. Well, you ain't even Don't close to I know, I know. You're making me nervous. I want to take Am it I? away from you. 
start down here and go up that way. Okay, go up. You can pour a little bit faster. It should all flow out, but it's pretty thick. So That's because I put that pigment in. So look yeah, and you're, you're eight minutes in since you started mixing right now. Okay, now what? Lift it. Get your finger under there. All right. Now I'm going to take it because you're making me crazy. Well, I'm doing good. I haven't spilled you anything. Do it. You did excellent, son. <laughs> Guys, just like my... Uh, what are the Pop Warner football games? You did great. And your mom's the one that got it over the edge. That's all right. I'm going to show how to fix it because that's what I do. I need another stick. Yeah, I'm kind of glad we didn't go with the sparkles. I, Amy just, she's not, she's like me. She's just kind of, she's not fancy, she's you know. She's not a bling gal? No, no. She wears one necklace, like, and that's about it. Well, she got a couple rings, but. That really looks cool. That black and red, what a good combo. Yeah. You need to stay back and stop it. You, you're going to piss mom off. Then she's going to end up throwing this at you, and I'm going to have to make another one. <laughs> Looks like you made the perfect amount, man. You're so good at this. Oh, uh, you know... Once that camera goes off. <laughs> You're in trouble. I remember being a kid and hearing Oh, you're telling stories now. And you Go just ahead. wait till you wait till I tell your father. Remember when you caught me eating a grape at New Deal? <laughs> or no, it was a snow cap. It was a little you know how they had the bins of uh, candy? The snow caps, a little like chocolate, chocolate kisses. Covered with a candy uh, yeah. on the outside. I reached my sprinkles. fat little hand up there and ate one and mom caught me, she's all Wait till I tell your father. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna look good. That's just talent right there. Okay, so now I I have a question. It looks like something is that a bubble right there or is that something it's a in bubble. okay. Alright, check now for any other kinda like Yeah, I'll get in we'll get in there. I really need a toothpick. Toothpick? A toothpick. Uh, I don't, I can run and get some. I've, I've got, got some, some in, in my shop. shop. Right. Mm -hmm. right. right. Wow, you guys are coming up with all kinds of fun. Now, now okay, you want me to uh, point something out? No, just let it dry and then pick right it there. up. Right there, you can't see it. I know, that's angle. what we need the toothpick for. Oh, and then there's another one right there. All right, I'm getting a toothpick. Can't see it from your angle. Uh, yeah, I can. Dang gum. That red looks good. Now, so I think what Dad was talking about here, there's like a streak going up the the edge. It, that that's really hard to see. Yeah, right I there? see it. Oh, okay. Just one. Go. All right. Excuse me, Dad. That's some monstrous toothpicks.
We're going to let this set for a long time, and then we're going to do the flood pour when we come back. So stick with us. Yes, so Good. anyway, five ounces of hardener, five ounces of resin. We made 10 ounces. Oop. Slowly. Slowly. And I can't do it loosely. Do it <laughs> very slowly. See, I knew that was coming. Yeah. What movie is that from? True Lies. True Lies. Great movie. Yeah. Jamie Lee Curtis, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Mm hmm. And, Tia Carrera. And. Tia Carrera. Uh, and. What's his oh name? yeah, Tom Arnold. Tom Arnold. Yeah. yeah. I was in love with Tia Carrera ever since Wayne's World. And I was in love with Jamie Lee Curtis. Ever since uh, what's that one? Looking good, Billy Ray. Feeling good, Lewis. Yeah. Trading places. Trading places. Eddie Murphy and Dan Aykroyd. And Don Amici and Ralph Bellamy. Your edges. Yeah, these are all like this. I'm going to go around the front. Oh. No, you're good. I'm just going to. Wow, that looks really good, guys. Yeah. Like that. Man, that cedar just pops. Okay. You really don't see any bubbles to speak of. What do you need? My torch. Uh, which Man, that black really kind of comes through. Kind of, yeah, it shows all the different. Uh, yeah, it has like a texture to it mm -hmm. down in there. Yeah. You can definitely see the difference in color using the pigment versus the opaque liquid color. Yeah. yeah this really shows it. It's a, like it's pearled. Yeah, it really shows a different uh, see? deep contrast between the two. Something's bothering you. What is it? Oh, I just, I like the way the black looks. The red looks super bright, but I like that it's kind of translucent a little bit. But that's all right. Okay, we're going to close enough to see that. Watch the cardboard right there, Dad. I'm going to try and get in close enough to see it. Once it's all done and we come back for the final uh -oh. scene. We have a glitter. A glitter? A glitter! There's That's... never just one. They're like ants. Uh -oh. Alright, guys. Oh, we have the bubble. There um, you go. That's right. it. Let me back her. Oh, I see something in here, too. That's in the wood. All right, guys. So we've got it poured. We're going to come back again every 15 minutes and zap it for bubbles. All right, guys. So here is the 99% finished product. I still need to sand off the back, but it's not quite uh, cured enough for me to lay it on its face. So we're just going to give it another day or two. It's like... I don't know, nine degrees here. Actually, actually, it's 32, but it feels like nine. But um, this is the final product. This is for my bride for Valentine's Day. And uh, that's Gus's, my dog Gus and my dog Olive. So she wanted something with both our dogs on there. And uh, Those are big dogs. Yeah, well, yeah. Gus's paw is probably actually bigger than that. It probably is. Olive's could probably fit in there, but... Um, so let's get some angles on it. There we go. Yeah, hold her right there. This thing just came out spectacular. And now lean it back just a little bit. Yep, a little bit more. Good. Yeah, this thing came out so nice. What it a did. beautiful board. Yeah, I think I think Amy's really gonna love it. Yep. So, so that's it for this one, guys. So I'm going to. Uh, we're actually, I'm going to give this to Amy before these air, which is good, because I don't want her to, I want her to see it in person first. Um, 
So as always guys, if you have any questions, you can email dad at eric at makeawoodsign.com. You can email me, ryanwithdavesigns at gmail.com. Um, all our products and stuff are on makeawoodsign.com. If you have any questions, just shoot us an email and we'll be uh, happy to help. And also don't forget about the premium membership. Oh, I just hit the microphone, sorry. The premium and executive memberships. Um, check it all out on the, the website. So until the next one, guys, we'll see you later.